Welcome back my friend to another reaction video. Hope you're having a good day and if you're not, I hope it gets better. This video is from Police Watch. Let's see what it's all about. Let's go. On March 24th, 2023, officers responded to a call about a man who was trespassing on private property and refusing to leave. And he like shut the door. Oh, it's a he? I don't know. I don't know. It's a person. I don't know. Okay. He drove right in. You should put Yo, what are you doing, man? Hey. How are you? Uh, uh, I'm sorry. Um, I'm, I'm well. How are you? You okay? Yeah, I'm, I'm absolutely wonderful. You know where you are? Absolutely unconditionally. I'm, I'm doing very, very, very well. You, where are you? I'm, I'm just sitting right here mm -hmm. doing a wonderful, a wonderful uh, sit down. So uh, okay, well your pants are kind of messed up. So you want to pull your <laughs> pants up? Um, I think my pants are just fine. They're not because I can see your pubic area. Um, I think I think and officer. I think you pissed yourself too. Officer, I don't believe that's officer. I don't believe that's right. Okay. Okay. I don't. Believe. Do you have any medical conditions or anything? No, I don't. No, I don't. You know you're in somebody's field right now, right? Yeah, you know I'm doing I'm doing fine. Um, I'm I'm gonna pull pull up my pants. Uh, the um, um, I just put them down just because I, you know, my my stomach was a little bit. Do you have your ID inflated. on you? Excuse me. Do you have your ID on you? Uh, what do you want? Your ID. I just asked you for your ID. Yeah, Alpha Fifty One. Do you have for transport for work? Does it matter? Yeah, yes, it does matter. You're trespassing on somebody's property. Um, I honestly don't believe I am. Okay. I, this is, really, is going to go one of two ways. You're either going to cooperate with me and maybe get checked out by fire rescue and leave it on your own accord. No, here. I'm, I'm, look, look. I'm going to reach under me. Hold on. Yeah, I'm, go ahead. Hold on. I'm going to reach under here. I'm going to give you my passport. Okay? Okay. And... Um, yeah, this is my passport. You know, it's my passport. <coughs> Hold on. <coughs> Hold on. Show me your hands. My hands are clean. Okay. My hands are clean. Step out. Not, How about that? Yeah. Step out of your car. Yeah. Hold on, sir. Sir, sir. Hold on. Man. You know, I'm chilling, man. I'm just chilling. Here, I'll give you. Your I'll wallet's give to you the right. I don't need money. Your wallet's to the right. Grab the wallet. Quit playing games. You want to go to jail? Just grab the damn wallet. You think I'm with you? You're in the middle of somebody's property. Grab your wallet and let's go. I don't got time to mess around. Look, man. I got. I just gotta say, this man, he has uh, a a medical condition. You guys, he does have it, and it's it's called too much drinking. You feel me? That's a big problem everywhere in the world. People just they get addicted to drinking, you know? Anything goes good, they want to drink. Anything goes bad, they want to drink. You know what I'm saying? It's like, there's some people that, like, they give them a Coke, like a Pepsi or Coca-Cola or any Sprite or whatever, and, and your beer, and you tell them to choose. And they're pretty much going to, most of the time, if they're not into drinking a lot, they're going to choose the, the, the better fresh mints, you know, the beverage. Uh, there's people that will just take the beer right away, you know what I'm saying? Uh, but yeah, he, he has a condition, you guys, too much drinking, too much getting into problems. That's a big property. I just got to say, but, and the police officer did offer him a way out. He said, you know, do we get the medical to check you out and you can go on your own accord or it'll be a different type of story. And, um, he, what got me though, man, is that he did PP himself, you guys. And, you know, for someone to do that, I mean, he, he must be drinking a lot, a lot. Because only a person that can drink so much all the time and get wasted wouldn't care anymore where to relieve their self, especially on their pants. And then he had a, you can tell he's still more down because if he would get up, his butt be sticking out. You know what I'm saying? And that's, that's kind of not cool, man. I guess he went in there thinking like it was just a field or something, but it is somebody's big property, acres of property. And he was talking about it. 
it's not right even though the police officer was pointing out that he peed himself and you could see his pubic hair and oh man oh no some people just need to stop drinking and he got some way out i think this is gonna get worse what do you think i think he's gonna get worse he's gonna get mad or something and it's not gonna work out oh don't drink and drive man i mean they can't get him for drinking and drive because he's just sitting there the keys are not ignition that i think or the car is on you know what i'm saying so i guess that's why he said you gotta way out i don't think he's gonna choose the right way you guys I don't think you just so. drove in somebody's property and probably destroyed some of his hoses i don't believe so you don't believe shit right now because you haven't been outside to look they tried to talk to you and you instead ignored them so grab your wallet all right hold on hold on uh, you know what you know what um i'm gonna pay hey, i'm gonna look, look hold me on. in my eyes look me in my eyes yes, i'm sir. not playing games with you i understand grab the wallet that's down there and show me your id yes sir nothing else grab the wallet yes sir where's your id um have you been drinking you smell like you've been drinking um and ridiculous no, you're a grown-ass adult aren't you how old are you uh 53 Where's your ID? It's under here. Where's under here? Um, it's I, I have a I, I, I honestly have a uh, um, yeah that's not gonna that's not gonna do you any bit of good. What does that <laughs> not do me any bit of good? Give me your ID. Okay. Well, it was it, what it's gonna be? It's gonna be um um uh, I'm uh seriously I'm gonna I'm gonna reach down here. You know what? You may need to reach in here to get it. I'm not reaching in there to grab nothing. Okay. No, well, grab what your is, ID what? like I've asked so many times. Okay. Grab your ID. Okay. What it is, it's a, uh, it's a, uh, it's a, uh, there, there, I have no Florida state license. I have no New York state license. What I have is a pure and simple Florida, no. I have I have a an ID across the board. So you don't have a driver's license throughout no, sir. the United States. No, you don't sir. have a Florida driver's license or a New York driver's no, license. No, sir. Who's the vehicle registered to? Myself. But you have no license. No, sir. Okay. Why did you drive here? Um, I thought it was uh, a safe place to be. Where do you live? I live in New York. So you're homeless right now. Yes, sir. Okay. Are you able to walk and stand on your own? Yes, sir. You sure you don't want to get checked out by fire rescue? I am absolutely not. Okay. Well, in order for you to prove that to me, because you look like you cannot take care of yourself, so I'm a little bit worried there. Are, are we okay for, for the moment? What do you mean okay for the moment? No, you're parked in their property. Okay. Um, you're committing trespassing. Oh, I didn't. I didn't mean to do this. I didn't mean to do that. Step you, out of the car. You know, I don't. I, sir, I didn't. Step I really, out of the car. That's not an. I'm not asking you. It's not like a. Hey, man, can you please step out of the car? We're already past that point because I've asked you the same question about 30 times, and you finally answered the truth, saying you don't have a driver's license. Make sense? So as long as you cooperate with me, I'm going to cooperate with you, and I'm going to okay. be nice to you. So where do we? If you do, do not go, cooperate we, with me, then I change to a different temper and thing I, fucking I changes. You understand? I, I understand. So, I understand. Step out of the car. Okay. So where are we at from here? Oh. Step right there. Where are we at from here? We'll be wherever I ask. Just go over there. No, I think I think, sir. I think Step over there. Step over there. You're in ants. Okay. Okay. You don't have any medical conditions at all. Not absolutely. I not. think you do because you peed yourself. Are you diabetic no, or anything? No, no, this is uh, this is just nothing. No, don't worry about it, man. Don't worry about it. It's all good. I am worried about it because you reek of alcohol too. Well, it's fine. Are you an alcoholic? Have you been drinking? What? Yeah, well, whatever. It doesn't matter, man. It does matter. No, I, if I'm, I'm asking you a roads. question, it matters. I'm not on your roads. You were just on the road because you had to get on the road to get here. I don't and now you're trespassing. So the only way for you to leave is to walk. You can't even drive because you've been drinking. You understand that? Okay. So the more, like I said, the more you try to fight me or I'm not, I'm not, not, I'm not, I'm not going or try there. to buck the system, it's going to get worse for you. I'm not going to go there. Okay. 
I'm not gonna go there. So I'm gonna have Fire Rescue come check you out. Yeah, sure. And then That's they'll fine. go from there. Sure. Okay. But you cannot drive. You have no driver's license. No, I'm, you're intoxicated, I'm fine. and this does not belong here. How old are you? Fifty-three. Alpha twenty-one. How did you get here? Explain that to me. Um, I'm I'm really good about what I do, man. Dude, I came down here. I saw I saw what happened in uh, uh, Fort Myers. Um, Fort Myers. Uh, I'm a I'm a. a 30-year veteran of electricity, and I came down here. <laughs> I have to pause this. They say he's a 30-something-year-old veteran of electricity, so that because this makes me... Oh, you guys, I'm up to use that. I'm a veteran of two years doing YouTube, you guys. Oh, that's a good one. Dude, man. I don't know what kind of story he's gonna try to put out there, man, to like try to um cover his decision to be drinking and driving unless he didn't drive unless he dropped um, um, okay I'm, I'm I'm back up a little bit maybe he drove there after he got his beer or whatever he's drinking he said he felt like a safe place to go there because I guess he's homeless because he don't live there he lives somewhere else and then he started drinking that could be a possibility you know what I'm saying uh and he. You know, he thought he was safe, but he's trespassing somebody's land, so that's a problem. That police officer, honestly, is being super nice to him, even though I get a feeling this, 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 I was gonna say super cop, <laughs> but this police officer is gonna be quick to hit the switch and, and get down to business. Another thing, it's not okay if you pee yourself. He says it's, it's, it doesn't matter, and then he says it doesn't matter, he's been drinking too. That's not cool. I guess that's why. He's the way he is because he thinks drinking is not a big issue, which it really is. There's too many accidents going on in the world, you guys, of people that want to go drink because they go to a party or a celebration or a club or something like that. They get really drunk and drove there and decide they're okay in their mentality at the time to drive back home or, or something. And they, you know, boom, they crashed, took some people with them or they themselves exited out this planet because they just wanted to consume something that would pretty much took him out of this world, you know, saying it's no longer them. Uh, and this man seems like when he drinks alcohol, he gets really negative and defensive for something that he knows he probably shouldn't be doing, but still does it. And now he's in the situation where he's on video and he has his pants peed. Oh no. <laughs> okay. You guys, I think it's gonna get bad. This police officer is trying to get him out. He opened a door for him, man, but this guy is looking for a window. <laughs> and that window ain't opened, okay? It's really closed. And oh, I no. saw, oh, I saw no. what happened with you folks um, down here in, uh, in Fort Myers. And I'm like, man, Charlie, you gotta go. That's me, that's Charlie. me, that's me. Charlie. Your name is Charlie. Charlie, 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 Charlie. You see, he's like, Charlie, you gotta go. Charlie, you gotta go. You, Charlie, you, Charlie, you gotta go, man. So Charlie, what's your last name? Yep. Yeah, yeah, no, I came down here. I, 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 I really, I turned and burned, um, just to get down here, just to help you folks, you know, make, make a difference for you folks. Um, and just however I could help, however I could help, you know, and that was it, man. That was it. Period. And I did good. I did good for, uh, you know, about, about. I don't know, 30 days or 60 days. I really kicked ass down here for you folks, man. You know, I was, uh, I came down just, just to do it for you folks. Well, whatever, you know, now, now I get penalized. I get penalized, you know, with you guys giving me a ration of shit. And I'm like, what the fuck, man? So do you think it was unwarranted me giving you a rash of shit or what it's warranted? You just I think it, I think it's unwarranted. Okay, look around where you are right now. I think it, I think it's Mark, you, I think it's look it. around where you are. Yes, sir. sir, you're in somebody's property. I think I think, I think it's okay for me. That's, that's the owner right there and he says it's not okay. That's why I'm here. Okay. So it's warranted. You understand that? Yeah. I just thought I just thought that I might You almost busted his line. Okay, but you I know how hard that is for a place to do one Martin Downs on Martin Highway. You I realize understand. you're driving on his property, marking up all of his dirt. 
Well, no, I understand. I understand, and I I was very very careful not to. No, you weren't. I was. <laughs> You're very, driving a vehicle over there. But I no no no, sir sir, look at the look at the the line. I did not walk. I did not drive on his property. So how'd you get here? Um, it would uh, somebody somebody an angel, an angel brought me here. So you want to play games, don't you? No, that's I okay. Just, I got a place for you. You want to play games? No, no, That's sir. Okay. It's no, okay. sir. No, sir. No, sir. It's okay. I don't. I just. I, no, no, you I, want to play I, games. I, no, an angel sir. dropped you here. Okay. Sir, sir. I, I don't. look young. I've been doing this ten years. Okay, I don't need. I honestly, I honestly don't need. I honestly don't need. Well, you're fixing to get played some games. So, Fire is going to come check you out, and if you don't go with them to get checked out, you're probably going with me. I'm going to Baker Act you because. You don't know where you are, pretty much. I know where I'm at. You don't. You said you got dropped here by angels. That's even greater. I'm going to well, put that on the Baker Act paperwork. No, that's not. And it's all on camera, the, what you just said. No, it's by bullshit. The way. It's all bullshit. Oh, it's bullshit. It's all bullshit. You just bullshit. said you, you got here it's by all angels. Bullshit. It's all bullshit. I'll tell your angel. I'll tell your angel right now. It's all bullshit. I'm trying to tell you to leave me alone. You know you're uh, parked on somebody else's property. That's the problem. Okay. Yes. So here, look at. And now you're look. intoxicated, so you can't drive yeah, away. Exactly. So okay. wh- how how can we manage this? Okay, fire rescue is going to come check you out, and you should probably go to the hospital to get checked nah, out. Yeah, that's not. You know, the Baker Act. They can kiss my black ass. That ain't going to happen. Okay. Whoa! Hold up a minute, man. This guy is confused. Yeah, he needs to get Baker Act. Hi, I don't. Am I? My eyes. Am I? I'm okay. I'm colorblind now. Oh, I just see white and gray. Oh my god. Oh no. All right, man. The story was like phenomenal. Okay. It was like, wow, this guy is a, a hero. You know what I'm saying? He, he dropped everything, went to, to fire, you know what I'm saying? To go help them in Florida. He said, what did he say? Charlie. Charlie, you got to go help him or something like that, right? I think his name's Charlie. And he did it, you guys. A lot of people don't jump to the opportunity where they see something drastically going bad. And they're like, you know what? I can help. But just get in the first train, airplane, sorcerer, something, you know what I'm saying? And I'm going to go. Drop everything. I don't lose my job. Everything. I'm going to go help him somehow. I'm going I'm, I'm to help people. And then after trying to do all that, he, he starts turning against the people he's trying to help. Like this police officer, he says it's not right for the police officer to wake him up. You know what I'm saying? From being real asleep. I don't know for how long. I don't I'm sure, you know, it probably smells like peeing the band and stuff looked at him. He, come on, you know what I'm saying? But he said it don't matter. It does matter, you guys. You know, especially if somebody's trying to knock on your window or whatever, trying to get you out. It's probably going to smell really bad. Urine. Uh, and then he's talking about angels took him there? And he was careful driving the van over somebody's property, like bus stuff. <laughs> oh no! Now they're doing a Baker Act. The police officer he's talking about is, is, is all lie, is bull. He's trying to like convince the officer he's not crazy no more and stuff like that. He knows probably what it means and stuff. And then he tells the camera, is bull. And then tells the police officer, I'll tell your angel. Did he say I'll tell your angel? Like. Okay, that's confuses. My guy needs help, mate. Oh, he's just taking him away. I think he's gonna get bad. You think, you think he's gonna? I think he's gonna really get bad. This guy, uh, I did like his story at first, though. I mean, whew, I was like watching a, a sad movie or a heroic movie. You, you know what I mean? He's making me try to reach inside my soul. And anything I see that's going wrong, I'm gonna just jump on it too. But I'm gonna make sure I don't drink, though. No. Oh, because I don't drink. And from being a hero, you become a super version. I'm just saying. Or, Baker Act. You feel me? The, the Baker, they can kiss my black ass. It ain't happening, man. I'm telling you what. I'm up out of New York State. Piss on them. You know what? Period ended. I'm not I'm not going anywhere, man. You, you can drag me up out of here. Ooh. You can do whatever you want to do with me. But I ain't going to no Baker Act, man. Okay. What are you going to do? We'll sit right here until you tell me what to do. So okay. if I say you're going to do a Baker Act, then what are you going to do? Uh, that's not that's not a possibility, Wait. sir. Wait. Okay. Okay. I don't think it's I don't think it's fair. Why don't you think it's fair? Because I'm I'm what healthy. What year is it right now? I'm healthy. What is year is it, it right now? 2022. I'm healthy as. I'm Who's a, the president? Uh. Oh, hopefully Trump, but oh, Biden's okay. a. So okay. whatever. Okay. 
It's 2022. It's 2022, and Biden's a cocksucker, and hopefully uh, Mr. Trump gets back in. Eagles westbound Martin Highway. When, when's the last time you stayed not in your van? Um, stay the night somewhere else. Um, oh, in, in my van? Yeah. Um, uh, yesterday. What are you going to do once you leave from here? Just sleep in my van. Just sleep in my van. I, you know, I'm not, I have no, you know, I'm not going anywhere. I'm not doing anything. You know, I'm just going to be peaceful and just, just hang out in my van. Okay. So you're not going to go fire rescue at all? No. I don't think it's fair. It's up to you. It's up to you, sir. I don't think you're doing too well of a job caring for yourself. Oh, I, think. I think I'm all right, man. I think I'm okay. I mean, okay. you're drunk and somebody. But healed. it's okay. But it's, it's, it's not okay. Uh, you know what? You know what? Since I'm just sitting in my van, what's it matter, man? What's it matter? What's it matter? I'm okay. It does okay. matter. You don't understand. Okay, I do. I you're do drunk under- on somebody else's property who does well, not then, want you here. Then, um, what? Here, here's the cool part. Yes, sir. Okay. Yes, sir. You'll go with fire rescue, mm-hmm. or you'll go with me, and this gets towed. I don't want that. Um, so can, I'd, I'd go with fire rescue if I was you. Do can we do something better than that? Nope. Mm. Not gonna happen. You're the one that made the decision to get drunk and drive onto somebody else's property and get your car stuck. It's not stuck. Okay, so why didn't you leave once you got here? It's not stuck. <laughs> All right, you guys. So like. He don't get the what the police say that he just decided to drive there and get like get drunk and drive there and, and get his van stuck. And he instead of saying it's not stuck, he should have said, I didn't drive drunk. You know what I'm saying? Like that's a good defense point right there. But he's not thinking like that. He's 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 drunk. Look, uh, look, man, I understand. Uh, you probably watched the video where I say that when I was young, there was a friend that became a friend that went by our house and he was homeless, sleep sleeping in his big one stuff like that. He had nowhere to sleep. So my dad let him like sleep in the backyard because he had a backyard with his car until he got better and got a job and was able to like find a place to live in the city you know what i'm saying i don't have a problem with people man when you gotta do something you gotta do it man if you got a car where you can live at because you can't afford to live in a house or something like that i mean you're trying to survive you know but there's people that really trying to survive trying to make it trying to get back in their feet which are not doing stuff that's gonna like hold them back kind of like drinking getting drunk and stuff like that i mean you know there's nothing to bad about drinking you guys so long as you know what you're doing respectfully and again if you're gonna get wasted do it at home don't cause no problems <sighs> this man ain't helping himself he's not he, he, his police officer is trying i don't know how many times i heard him he's trying to help him out give him the decision to just go to fire with the fire department and, and, and move on but he don't understand that the police officer can't let him drive off he don't have a driver license he already admitted he got a driver license he's drunk how is he gonna let him drive out first or go anywhere and there's no other option oh sometimes the alcohol man i'm telling you man alcohol ain't helping you it ain't your friend when you get really stupid like that and get drunk alcohol is just gonna make it worse for you and this man don't understand it i mean i wish him the best in the future hopefully he watches this video and understands he shouldn't be doing that kind of stuff like like you know what i mean if he's trying to stay on the van i guess you can park like under a bridge or something like that for a little bit uh there's other places where you can actually like a side of the freeway for a little while but don't be drunk to where a police officer comes up to you just to see if you're okay you're all not drunk and smelling like alcohol you can just be honest, like, I ain't got nowhere to stay, officer. You know what I'm saying? Uh, uh, and they might give you some options. <sighs> oh, I don't know what to tell about this guy, man. It's <laughs> just like this police officer ain't got no choice but to either get rid of the man, make him go somewhere, or arrest him because the owner's there. And the owner's called on um, this man. And there's only two options. They're just doing their job. <laughs> oh, I'm going to pray for this man, man. He needs help. Maybe he should make crack him. I don't know. What do you think? What do you think? It's not no, I can turn and burn. Seriously, you know, I can turn and burn. Mm-hmm. You know, officer. You know, I, I honestly. How I much did you drink today? Um, I don't know, like one, two. I, I think I've had at, at least two, at least two. Okay. Why were your pants pulled down when I pulled up? Because it was just comfortable. It was comfortable. It was just because it was comfortable. You know you're on somebody else's property, right, though? But it was comfortable. It wasn't, okay. it had nothing, it had nothing to do with anything. Oh. Inappropriate? Oh. 
It had nothing to do with uh, anything other than that, officer. Alpha 10, 10, 6, you know, 5, 5. You know, I don't, I don't think that we should, um, you know, you and I shouldn't talk about you know, the, the stupidness about the, the car. Come on, man. Come on, man. Really? There's no come on, man. I already told you your options. Well, that's it's that simple. Where, what, where, where are we at? What, 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 fire rescue comes. What, what, you go what, fire what, rescue to get checked out. Go to the hospital to get checked out. Or you go with me, and this gets towed. I don't. I don't like that. I, I'm not the one that put you in this predicament. You did I it don't. I don't think. I don't. You know. Honestly, honestly, officer. Honestly, I mean, I like you. I like mm. you as a friend. Um, all my friends are. I'm looking. I'm squaring you up. Do you have friends here? Somebody that could pick you up? Nope. Um, uh, no. I listen. I'm. I'm squaring you up right in that camera right there right now. I'm squaring you up right in that camera. I'm squaring you up. What does squaring up mean? It means I'm telling you, I know what I'm talking about. Okay. So, okay. you know. You know what you're talking about as far as what? Yeah. 1097. That camera. Right there. That camera. Right there. Oh, that camera. Okay. Right there. But what besides the camera? I, I don't believe that you're, uh, you're uh, on agenda. On agenda. Yeah, I don't. I don't believe that you. What you're approaching me with it right now is uh, is legitimate. <laughs> yeah. Now you're it's you're legitimate. flinging. You're flinging. You're flinging chow. Oh, you're spitting. What? what is this like a dare or something like that? Oh, I can spit better than you. That's what's going on here. Oh, I don't seen everything. I'm sure I don't know what a police officer spitting. Maybe he has like a throat problem. Like you know, when my throat was really messed up, I had to spit a lot. But I mean, I, I, honestly, I'll try to avoid it on the street or anything like that. Actually, I wouldn't even go out. I just uh, order some food or go get the food and come back because um, yeah. Uh, sometimes I, I feel like it's a little disgusting, you know, but sometimes you have no choice but to spit it, especially, like I said, you got a, a throat infection or something like I had for a while. But this man right here just took it like like he better. He a better spitter. Like there's a contest going on. Who's going to win number one? Oh, it is two people. But I think you know who's going to win the police officer, right? And this guy still don't understand that there's a problem. Like if if he wouldn't be an alcohol, I'm sure he'd be like, "Oh, I'm sorry, officer. Oh man, it's like I'm homeless and stuff. I can't become a hero in Florida trying to help people because I saw the devastation that was going on, and I had to just jump on right off the train and just start work. You know what I'm saying? But what happened was is that I ain't got nowhere to stay. I lost my job or something, and I live. I gotta live in my van. I thought this would belong to nobody. I thought it was just land that was, was unclaimed, like back in the, the 1800s and the 1700s and stuff like that. I was just trying to get some sleep, man. All oh, this not this. This is water. I was drinking on some some water and stuff, and it, I fell asleep because I was tired. It went all over my pants and stuff. But hey, guess what, man? You want me to step out? Okay, well, you want me to walk away? I'll walk away. I'll, I'll come back for the van another time. No problem, sir. Have a good day. That's what I would do. I think he would do, but it ain't gonna happen, right? It's not gonna happen. You know it's not gonna happen. No, oh, no. I'm sick. Oh. I'm sick. That's yeah. why I'm Yeah, yeah, that. okay. So am I. I'm sick. Okay. Yeah, guess what? I don't like it. Okay. Ooh. All right. So I don't think that... So you we... have no friends or family that you can call? Absolutely not. Okay. Absolutely. Have you ever been back corrected before? Absolutely not. Have you ever been homicidal, suicidal before? Absolutely not. Okay. Absolutely not. There's no reason. There's no reason for you and I to have this conversation. Uh, there is because you're on somebody else's property. Like okay. I've explained so many times to you. Okay. I'm not going to explain that again to you. Well, do you I think don't. you can just talk your way out of everything? It's not going to work. All right. So where are we at, there, uh, officer? I already told you your two options. <laughs> What's and my, it's going to be one option soon. Yeah. You're going to get checked out by fire rescue. Nah. Those people. Oh, okay. That did it. That did it. Hands behind your back. Hands behind your back. Put your hands behind your back. Crazy. What the f is wrong with you? Huh? You don't want to listen? What did I just tell you? Huh? You're not going to f listen? We have come to the conclusion, you guys. So right there. Ace in the dirt. 
Ferris can come check you out, and then you're gonna get back right. Thank you. <clears throat> you hear me? Fuck off. I'm telling you what, man. If I could get up, I would kick your ass. That's fine. <clears throat> you can't tense up when I'm going to put handcuffs on you. Yeah. That's what happens. Because you're, you're a little bitch. And you, won't, you won't even play with me. Wow. I don't play with him neither. Look at it. You see that? That's blood. See that? That's fine. That's blood. That's you. That's you, you mother. That's you. You're a. That's my blood. I'm calling you what, man? You're a f***ing asshole. You're a f***ing asshole. I'm from f***ing New York State, out of control. My daughter lives in... SO TAC 2. SO TAC 1. SO TALK. SO TELETYPE. My daughter lives in f***ing Syracuse. You're an asshole, you f***ing cocksucker. Hey, boss! You're a f***ing cocksucker, man. I don't give a shit. And you don't listen. No. I'm telling you what right now. I'm telling you. My boys are about a New York State, New York State troopers, New York State boys, New York State. They will f***ing throttle your ass. You're a f***ing douchebag, man. You're a f***ing asshole. You'll probably be going with me with a big rack now. I'm what? I'm well. You're well? I'm well. All right, well, let's check you out, okay? Yeah. Tell this cop to fuck off. Yeah, well, I'm not going to do that. Thanks for letting me go the other day. Here. You want to oh, hey. no. do these? <laughs> no, yeah. we can't do that. We're going we're well, to check, we're gonna check out. you out. We're going to check you out, okay? Yeah, yeah. Let's do this. Let's, uh, stand, let's stand up, up and walk over to our restaurant. That's when I went on to. Let's do that. My guy, my guy was arrested for resisting arrest and trespass. Oh, you guys, like, so many chances gave him, but that alcohol is not a great friend. It's an angry friend. And you know, like they say, if you hang around with the angry friend, eventually you get angry too. Whether it's a game for, uh, you know, towards the friend or just you just become the friend. And it kind of sucks, man. Like, he, he got so many chances, like, two chances. Go get checked out and leave or get arrested. And he chose to get arrested. Like that that don't make no sense. And even though the police officer was trying to be nice, that he's at the end he still like spit bad words at him. Oh, I told you, man. I thought he was probably gonna be sick or something like that. Cause it's uh because I was like, oh, he's spitting. I mean now there's a lot of people that just spit because they just want to spit. But uh oh, oh tell you, man. My guy, he's confused, all right, man. He's really confused. I don't, you know, he said he was, he said, kiss my black butt. And, and yeah, I think he's confused, you guys. I'm just saying, well, uh, yeah, yeah. All right, let me go, let me think, let me think. Tell me what you think about this video and this man. <laughs> the police officer was A okay, you guys. The nicest person I've, police officer I've seen trying to help somebody that really looked like he was in the right. But yeah, let me know. Thank you for watching. Thank you for your time. Hit the like button because it really helps this video out. And because you hit the like button, YouTube will suggest this video and other videos to other people that have never seen it before. And that's the best way to support the channel. And I would really, really appreciate it. If you want to watch another video, you can watch this one right here or this playlist. And I will see you next time. Bye.